Okay, so this is just a brief process of um, configuring the antipass back. <laughs> Um, the access panel in question uh, the access panel for the location in this case now we are trying to configure a lucky access panel this will not also go this okay after the selection of the le of the particular panel in question it will take you to the location page then you navigate your way to the options once you get to the options you can click on modify and then make sure the timed antipass back and the store area antipass back location are checked. So if those two locations are checked, then you can go to your readers and your areas to configure the antipass back. Without these two checked, your antipass back will not be effective because this is areas where you actually put it into action. Straight up, this is lucky configuration and then let me expand the access panel so for the lucky access panel now it's obvious that the anti-pass back features has been activated so the next is to go to areas areas is where you configure where those anti-pass back will be um, activated so from this area now there are a lot of areas entry and area leaving that has been created so the purpose of this anti -pass back is to create an area entry and area living in this case now you are talking about your reader in and reader out because these anti -pass back features can only work on two readers door on a door which means there is master and there is slave without master and slave there is no point for configuring anti -pass back so area entry is more or less like your reader in why area living is more or less like your reader out so for every door that you want to configure and pass back on you have to create an area or you have to create two areas for entering and leaving so we'll quickly do that you come to hard button add you select the locations you remember the access panel you've activated earlier you locate the access panel which in this case is lucky then you click on ok all you are doing is just to create ignore every other thing just create a name a unique name lucky lucky area entry don't mind the keyboard is a 2016 keyboard i'm in 2006 keyboard <laughs> all right so lucky area entry is created it's important you uh, use a unique name as many as possible so in this case now if lucky area entry if you know the name of the doors try to put the name of the door so that is important because that is what you will use to differentiate each of the door when you're about to configure so, but for this um, exercise, we just quickly look at area entry. All right. So now, area entry is done. You click on OK. So, lucky area entry has been created. We need to hard for area living as well. Same approach. I'm um, same process. Lucky, OK. Then you put your lucky area living you click ok so this lucky area entry and um, lucky area living is dedicated to a door which we're going to get to now all right so area configuration is set then we go to the particular readers and doors so under the particular readers and doors we identify the readers which are listed here you can check mark the access panel so that the all the locations can be listed in series you can see bb you can see lagos um head office and then uh, and this is lucky 
So, like I was trying to explain earlier, you need to define the name of the door in the area entry and area living so that you can configure properly. This ATM door now, you sh um, if we had known this ATM door, we would have add we will have added that ATM door to that configuration so that it's unique to ATM door. Nevertheless, we will check mark the ATM door that we want to configure for that lucky area entry and area living. You come to, obviously it will take you to general first when you come to this page, then you find your way to anti back and then you modify. Click on modify, then select lucky area entry then the area living is don't care that's for the reader in for reader in let me take it again the reader in we use entering for the configuration and for reader out we use living for configuration but all configurations will be on area entry while area living for both will be don't care so like we've done here area entry for lucky area entry don't care and then on the other part let's take a moment so for the reader out you have you do the same modify and the already on the area entry you put your area living and the other part you put don't care and then you are done so just a comment the more area entry you create the more area entry or area living you create on the areas configuration the longer the list you will have on on these doors on these readers and doors so it's important you leave a unique name so like this area entry should have been lucky atm door area entry if you want to create the next lucky back office area entry lucky back office area living and so on so the more you create the area on the areas where you want to go and fast back, the longer the list you will have for selection on anything that has to do with lucky access panel, like we have here. So here we are putting area living and don't care and done. The anti fast back will be effective. Thank you. Thank you, my five.